My name is Hans Austin. I'm a big supporter of Obama. I've always been a supporter of him since he was a senator. And now I'm going to vote him all the way. And I'm encourage my son and daughter to vote him November 4. And I'm sure that they are making the right choice. Thank you. Hi, my name is Yanni Dominic. I support Obama because he's a great leader and he loves the children. He loves the young students. He's for education. It's for the people that work hard and help the poor. And he's a great leader. Hi, my name is Yana and I support Obama because he's smart. And um, the key is educational. And he supports everyone. My parents watch him every day. My name is Joel Malbranch. I'm supporting Obama because he's a great leader. It's time for us to have a new a change. In, uh, for everybody, the middle class and the students uh, is, uh, need to have a leader who cares about them very much. I'm supporting him and I hope he, he got the, the, the presidency. <laughs> Hello, uh, my name is Harry Sanders. I'm supporting Obama because I believe in the change that he want to make for this country. He want to change the direction for the better. Hi, my name is Patrick, Patrick Joseph. Show you how we look up. Okay, all right. It's a pleasure for me to be here. You know, it's time for a change. It's time, you know, for a new leader. A time uh, for the economic problem to be on, um, you know, on our side, you know, on the, on the mass side. You know, not the, wet, the, the, the Wall, Street, Wall Street side. So we need a change. We need a change and Obama is the best. He's the president. He should be the president. We love him. Thank you. Houston, I'm Haitian and I'm here to vote um, for Obama because I believe in him. I believe in his uh, views about uh, improving the economy. And uh, I believe that the country needs a change. And I'm, I'm voting Obama. And I'll be there. Great choices and he's trying to help our world. Apple Corridan. A uh, member of the Florida Finance Committee for uh, Barack Obama's campaign, uh, corporate lawyer in Miami and New York, and a classmate of Senator Obama's from law school, Harvard, 1992. We're glad to be here. I have a question. I have a question for every one of you here today. What are you going to do? be a bystander in this election? Are you going to sit back and see what happens? Are you going to let others do the work and just hope for the best? Are you going to do exactly what the Republicans want you to do, which is stay home? Are you going to stay home on election day? Are you going to stay home during the early voting period? Are you going to let anyone turn you away from the polls this no! year? Are you going to let anyone take away your right no! to vote this year? Or instead, are you going to make this election your election? Yeah! Are you going to register to vote if you haven't done so yet? Right here, right now, today, yeah! before you leave. Are you going to talk to everyone you know? Are you going to make a commitment? Are you going to promise me right now that you will speak to at least 10 people and make sure that they've registered to vote before October 6? Are you going to make that promise to me right now? Are you going to make sure everybody you know votes? Are you going to make sure that everybody you know, including yourself, votes early starting October 20th? Yes. Are you going to stand up? Yes. Are you going to stand up for Barack? Yes. Are you going to stand up for change? Yes. Are you going to stand up for your state of Florida? Yes. Are you going to stand up for your children? Yes. Are you going to stand up for Haiti? Yes. Are you going to help us win the state of Florida? Yes. And my brothers and sisters, if you do this, if you do this, you will be the reason 
that we win the state of Florida. You will be the reason that we win this election. You will be the reason that we elect Barack Obama as president of the United States of America. The change is three simple words. President Barack Obama, it's in your hands. Yes, we can. Yes, we can. We can. Pour ça, nous qui haïtiens, yo di que haïtiens pas voté, yo di que haïtiens pas campé pour changement, yo di que haïtiens pas capable. Est-ce que nous d'accord avec eux? Yo dit que nous mêmes haïtiens que nous pas fait partie de aucun progrès dans le pays d'Amérique. Est-ce que nous d'accord avec eux? Yo dit que nous mêmes haïtiens que le 4 novembre la pchit à la caille nous. Est-ce que nous d'accord avec eux? Est-ce que nous parler pour nous montrer que nous mêmes haïtiens, même gens que nous décampé en 1804 Pour la liberté, pour le progrès, n'a pas campé le 4 novembre. Pour liberté pays ça, même gens que nous décampé pour nous libérer la savane, même gens que nous sommes nous décampé, que n'a pas campé aujourd'hui, élection ça, n'a pas voté, n'a pas voté pendant période et, et octobre, vers octobre, nous pas tant le 4 novembre même, n'a pas bien tant voté en vent le 4 novembre, nous pas qu'à faire rien, nous pas qu'à rêter nous, nous pas qu'à faire nous pas voter, droit ça c'est pas nous lier. Est-ce que nous d'accord? Est-ce que nous, est-ce que nous d'accord? Est-ce que nous capables? Est-ce que nous capables? Bah attendez nous, est-ce que nous capables? Est-ce que c'est non nous pas capables? Oui nous capables. C'est oui nous capables. Oui nous capables. Mes amis, mais dis nous, vive Haïti, vive les États-Unis d'Amérique. Vive Barack Obama. Merci en pile. Et vive peuple haïtien en Amérique et en États-Unis et, 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 et en Haïti. Ensemble, n'a bien le gain, n'a élu Barack Obama prochain président. Merci beaucoup.